So, um, what are we gonna do tonight, O.C.? Well, the same thing we try to do every night, but to take her for the words. Uh, I mean, YouTube. Take her by YouTube. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Obsessive Compulsive Gaming. I am the Obsessive Compulsive Gamer. Joined once again by my faithful manservant slash fuck totem Bertram. Say hello, Bertram. Hello, Bertram. And this is my review for Pumpkin Jack. So, my friends, Pumpkin Jack was released on the 27th of October for the PlayStation 5 and is as we gaming professionals call a platformer. Um, what's a platformer? Well, it means you do a lot of jumping, Bertram. In fact, you do more jumping in this game than a bloody pogo stick enthusiast. Um, what's a pogo stick? Well, tis something you jump up and down on. Rather like a trampoline, or your mother's bed, or a trampoline on top of your mother's bed. Oh! Not only is this a platformer, this is a 3D platformer. Which means... Um, that it's a platformer in 3D? Yes, indeed! Um... This game looks very Nightmare Before Christmas. Is this a Nightmare Before Christmas game? No, no it is not. Oh! Though, this game does feature Santa Claus, and a protagonist called Jack, and pumpkins. Maybe this is a Nightmare Before Christmas game. Oh, yay! Quite. So, story. We play as Pumpkin Jack. Um, any relation to Jack Skellington? Actually, yes. He is Jack Skellington's brother-in-law. But he's not a very good brother-in-law because he has been having an illicit affair with Jack Skellington's wife, Sally. Um, wouldn't that mean he's having an affair with his own sister? Uh, yes. Yes, it would. Oh, I'll never be able to watch The Nightmare Before Christmas ever again. Well, that's a terrible shame. <clears throat> Not so. Moving on. Gameplay. Now you traverse forests, cities, a graveyard, and even a swamp, hacking and slashing your way through the undead, using more weapons than bloody Crocodile Dundee. You use a sword, a spear, a gun, and even a scythe. Um, I sat on a scythe once. It was most unpleasant. Yes, quite. Speaking of which, did you know, Bertram, that God himself uses a scythe to create the bum cheeks of every man, woman, animal, and child? Um, I did not know that. You see, Bertram, obsessive compulsive gaming isn't just damned entertaining. It's also educational. Yes. What the hell was I even talking about? Oh, yes. Lots of levels, lots of enemies, and lots of weapons to dispatch said enemies in said levels. There are also sequences where you can remove your head. Ah, just like Jack Skellington. Yes, just like Jack Skellington. 
I can do the same trick, but with my Colonel Mustard. Um, I see. So yes, you can take off your head to explore small spaces. It is here you will solve puzzles that take the form of mini-games, like remembering a sequence of notes or whack-a-mole. Um, you do what to a mole? Whack a mole, not what you thought I said. Oh. Thankfully, these puzzles are so simple, even Simon the Simpleton could solve them. Um, I hear Simon hasn't been well recently. Oh dear. What happened? Um, he stuck his fingers in a wall socket and electrocuted himself. Well, that, that doesn't surprise me, Bertram. He is a simpleton after all. So, what else can I tell you about the game, dear viewer? Ah, uh, oh yes! You can ride many things in this game. Mine carts, horses, but sadly not Bertram's mother. Mostly because there isn't a saddle large enough for that morbidly obese creature. Um, are you making fun of my mother? Oh no, Bertram. I am making fun of, uh, the Pope. Oh, really? No, not really. So, what did I think of Pumpkin Jack? Well, this is a very fun little platformer that's very reminiscent of Crash Bandicoot, including boss fights that are equal parts fun and equal parts rip your head out and jump out of the bloody window frustrating. Oh, that's why you jumped out of the window. Yes, quite. <clears throat> But this is a great little game, and gets my recommendation, which as we all know, is the only recommendation you should trust. Therefore, I'm going to give Pumpkin Jack an 8 out of 10. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. My review for Pumpkin Jack. If you've enjoyed this little review of mine, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. If you haven't enjoyed it, well then, feel free to give me a thumbs down. Don't forget to hit that bloody like, subscribe, bell button thingy. Feel free to share this video with everyone you know. But, remember the single most important thing I always tell you, dear viewer. And that is to always stay obsessed with gaming. Say goodbye, Bertram. Goodbye, Bertram. Are you still here? Go away. I'm sure you've got something better to do with your time. No, seriously. Piss off. Be gone. Au revoir. I'll be the same. What in the hell is wrong with you? Go away! Vacate this space! Hit the cross at the top of the screen! The video is done! It's over! It's finito! It's caputo!